Hey, top of the morning. How's it going? Uh, welcome to Friday's edition of Talking Cancer. My journey, my way. It's the 28th day of April, 2023. And I'd like to welcome you to um, a little over a week of episodes. Again, this, this show tunes in uh, every Monday through Friday, 8 a.m., uh, depend on my distrib- distribution, um, sometimes you'll catch it around 8.30 or 9, but always on Spotify at 8 a.m. Um, and if you're wanting to listen on a different platform, you can find me on uh, Pandora, Apple, iHeart, Google, um, you name it. So, but again, I appreciate everybody for tuning in. Uh, The past few days, again, it's still been a little overcast and foggy, but it ends up turning out to be a beautiful day in San Diego. Rolling with my top down. Anyway, (laughs) Uh, but no, today is a great day, um, a beautiful day. Um, I thank God for the wake up, of course, and you should too, Um, but I'm not going to tell you what to do and how you or what your beliefs should be, Um, but thank God for the wake up, anyway, so um, today is really just about um, a couple of things, it's going to be one about love and inspiration, and invitation, invitation is going to probably mean a few things, but right now, um, we just want to deal with the invitation of this podcast. This podcast invitation goes out to you. Um, the person who wants a voice. I reach out to you um, and invite you to my show. If you'd like to submit a request to be on my show. And talk about either your your journey in the middle of battling this cancer, your survival, how have you beat it, or even if you are a sibling, a spouse, someone that deal is probably dealing with the day to day life of probably taking care of somebody with cancer with cancer. Um, And just going through those daily emotions, uh, pain, uh, how do you deal with dealing with that loved one? Um, I think this is very, um, you know, stories that should be told. And I'm in, I'm doing this because I want to help. I I feel for me alone. Uh, That just talking on a daily basis, just releasing my um, whatever I feel is going on in my brain um, to to be therapeutic, um, a journal, if you will. You know, some people write. I started a podcast. Why not? Right. Yeah, let's do it. Um. But that's the invitation. If you'd like to submit a request, you can submit that request to cancer, my journey, my way at gmail.com. If you didn't get that, you can submit your request to be on my show to cancer, my journey, my way at gmail.com. Um, so thank you. Um, also the invitation is to invite peace into your world, to invite love into your world, to invite conversation into your world, to invite vulnerability into your world, humbling yourself to the things around you, the people around you. Because I feel as it, 
as as you do that, you drop a lot of excess baggage you might have had. Now, I can't speak for everybody, but I happen to have had a lot of baggage. Um, and letting a lot of that stuff go, um, understanding that my past is not a reflection of my future. Has changed me a lot. So I invite you to accept this challenge. See how it works for you. Let me know. Let yourself know. But don't let me know at all. But I guarantee you that you will start looking at things a little bit differently. Analyzing things a little bit differently. Analyzing the people in your space. Analyzing the positive and the negative. You know, weeding out things that don't belong. Tending to your garden. If that makes any sense. I like to breathe a lot. I like to meditate a lot. I pray throughout the day. I find myself being thankful for so many things throughout the day. Um, It's becoming a regular uh, habit to do this for me. Um, Just being appreciative and always speaking uh, God's name somehow, some way. Now, I mean, for those that know me, I'm, I'm not a religious guy. I really ain't. When I say that, uh, meaning in probably your normal religious fashion, um, go to church, go to mosque, go to, you know, this or that. No, that's not, that's not me. You won't find me in my, in your, in my Sunday best. Going to church every Sunday or either, either or probably never, never Sunday. <laughs> but my belief, my belief system is strong. You know, for those that believe or don't believe, I I speak with God regularly. And every so often, he'll have some answers for me. You know, I understand he's a busy guy. But, you know, that's where I'm at with that. Um, my belief system is my belief system. And I, I feel like as if everybody has their way. Of doing things, but if you're a believer, you're just you're a believer, and um, I don't feel like having to go to church is um, the answer for everybody. You know, simple communication amongst two indiv- individuals um, is congregating. If you're speaking about God, you're congregating. You're having church at that moment. Church is in your heart. Church is wherever you deem it to be necessary to talk about God. My feelings, my interpretation, um, and everybody's entitled to that. So I invite you to just reach within yourself and do some soul searching about you, about your disease, about um, letting go. Okay? That's my invitation to you. Seriously, um, it's a serious thing in, in the healing process of your of your body and and coming to grips of no matter what. Don't worry about the outcome of the disease because the outcome of life is the same with or without it. Boom. Message. I find myself funny sometimes, you know? Um, So, yeah. Um, But, yeah, let's talk more about uh, inspiration. Because yesterday, um, I left my episode with a lot of facts. Um, And if you didn't tune in, please do so. Uh, A lot of facts. And and, and honestly, it, it uh, it left me pretty heavy yesterday 
as I replayed um, the facts in my mind, it left me heavy. So I need to uplift myself. You know what I mean? And so we're on a brighter note today because I know the sun is going to be out and it's Friday, TJIF, and, and I won't have it any other way. You know, life is too short to to dwell on yesterday or the past. So we're going to move on. You know, be thankful for, you know, your kids. Look at them. Smile. Um, give them a hug. A big hug. A, me- a meaningful one. You know, there's something about giving a kid a hug or your wife a hug or someone you love a hug and just uh, giving them a hug. And there's something about giving them a hug and breathing and exchanging energy of love. Very, very inspirational, very healing. Um, So do that. Make sure you tell your loved ones you love them every day. That is not hard. You know, we um, we definitely need it. Just as just as a whole, just as a, a as a universe. Um, there's so much love that's missing. So. Uh, show respect to your your neighbor, your co-workers, you walk in with a smile, shake their hand. You know, greet them properly. Change the atmosphere. Change the dynamic in your office, out in the field. You know, you be the, you you start the change. You know, if you start the change, it's a trip because like I go to work now, right? And I started to make these changes upon, upon, you know, upon myself. And, and I walk in the office, right? And... Right away, my supervisor there, you know, before I used to walk in, good morning, kind of gloom, glim, gloom, whatever, gloomy, just melancholy, just good morning, keep it moving, you know, I might say good morning to a couple people in the office as I make my rounds to get my water or whatever it is I'm doing, Uh, but now I walk in. And I give my supervisor a, 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 a handshake and like one of those little manly hugs. Good morning, man. What's going on? And I do it with a smile. How's it going? How's your morning? Create a little conversation. Water cooler talk. You know, go through go throughout the office. You know, shake everybody's hand. How's it going? Good morning. You know, how you doing? What would you have for breakfast? You know, whatever. Small talk. Really changing the atmosphere and watching people smile. Um, Shining my light. Because I don't need to have that. You know what I mean? So I I do what I can to try to continue that throughout the day. Um, You know, you have, sometimes it could get a little dim at times, but you got to turn it back on. Hold on. Don't mess with my light. Turn it back on. For real. It's all about realizing where you're at in the moment and catching yourself. You know, because we could, we could go down a rabbit hole really quick and not be able to turn around. You know, so before you go down there, you start seeing is, hey, turn around. For real. So this uh, this episode is uh, is just exactly what it is. Enjoying life. Uh, it's TGI Friday. You know, go have dinner with somebody. Go have lunch with somebody. You know, smile with somebody. Walk in your office. Shake their hand. Smile. Indulge in conversation. You know, change the way that person looks at you or you look at them. Even if you guys don't get along or that's the person everybody talks about in the, in the office, you know, change that dynamic, find out who they are, find out why they are the way they are. You know what I mean? Maybe they want a friend, but have their guards up. 
Maybe they're the coolest person in that office, but have their guards up. Because whatever. A little gossip, a little office drama. Maybe something's going on at home. You know what I mean? You never know what somebody's going through. Help yourself help them put a smile on their face. Come into the day a little bit differently. You know what I mean? Hey, it is what it is, right? So, anyways, this isn't going to be a long episode today. I think I've been running into like, I noticed myself just really getting into what I'm talking about. And I just want to keep it short for you guys. Uh, But the invitation is open. Uh, Please submit your requests to cancermyjourneymyway at gmail.com. If you choose to be on my podcast and share your journey, we'd love to hear it. Pretty sure the world would love to hear it. It's very therapeutic. I find it. Everybody don't rock that way. Some people, you know, submerge themselves, you know, kind of just do their own thing. Some people embrace. Some people write. Some people just read. Some people listen to music, tune out. You know, whatever it is you want to do. I find it therapeutic to talk. If you want to talk or even just share your experience to somebody else that might need it, that's kind of how I feel about this. Share your experience because somebody might need to hear what you're going through. It doesn't matter the type of cancer you're going through. And maybe over time as my show continues to grow, um, maybe I'll reach extend an olive branch to other diseases as well. You know what I mean? But right now, I just want, I need to focus just on cancer itself because it's very important to me walking in stage four uh, metastatic colorectal cancer. So you want to submit your request, please do so. Cancer my journey my way at gmail.com. If you want to help out with some of my bills, hit my GoFundMe up, Luis Lopez, Cancer My Journey My Way. Um, and you'll find me. So I appreciate you. Everything is all love. It's Friday. Smile. Have a great lunch. Treat yourself. Hey. There it is. I love you. Peace. One.